hello everybody and welcome back to my channel lumen moon tarot so everyone i'm checking into the weekend energy okay seeing what's going on around you in love for the weekend just take what resonates leave the rest behind and thank you so much to all of my subscribers a huge thank you thank you everybody new here welcome all right so spirit what messages do you have for my beautiful collective we made it to the weekend you guys though it's been a it's been a tough week um so yay congratulations all right so ooh. all right oh boy Oh, this person knows they need to do something like right now. They know they need to do something right this. I mean, honestly, they're in so much regret. Um, they chose a third party situation, a toxic person over you. OK, now you're moving forward. You're like, I'm out. I'm out of here. You could be a cancer. You could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Your person could be a Capricorn or maybe an Aquarius. Oh, man, they know they need to choose and they need to do it now because you're not slowing down. You're not waiting. You're not going to sit in stagnancy anymore. I feel like you have um, an opportunity uh, like this could be an opportunity. Of, um, maybe you're making a house move because I'm seeing a lot of forward movement. You could be moving from like a rural area into the city, maybe. Because it looks like you're on the move and this person knows it. They feel so stuck. I'm getting the sense that they've been watching you. They know that you're moving on um, very quickly. Okay. And they're about to cut off a karmic individual here. They don't want to, they know they're being burned in this situation. They're, this karmic could be very vain. They may, um, they may use your person for money. There could be some toxic addictions too. Like I feel like this person has been um, on some kind of substance. It could be drinking. It could be anything that they do too much of. But they're, they're, it's becoming very toxic. They're becoming addicted to something. Maybe that both of these people do together. Yeah, and they're about to break it off with this um, with this karmic. I feel like it's a karmic situation this person is in. Oh my gosh, are they regretting this? They can't sleep at night. This person's having a lot of anxiety, doing a lot of crying, okay? Nighttime is very hard on this person because, like, the whole world is quiet. And this person is left with their own thoughts, um, looking at their own toxic patterns of behavior i i just get the sense that they they feel like they're in like this hole that they can't climb out of um and maybe they're not wanting to um they're not wanting to confront this karmic okay but yeah they're closing out a cycle you're closing out a cycle you're both doing the same thing um it's just that you're taking a different direction okay and um, yeah, this person is about to speak their truth. They're about to make a decision when it comes to love. Their decision may be too late. It may be too late by now. But they want to come and heal this with you. Okay? They're about to offer you um, an apology or some kind of offer. But it looks to me like you don't want to hear it anymore you don't want to maybe even see them anymore you're not speaking to them and you're not budging either okay this person has a lot of love for you collective they know they chose the wrong person they really screwed up um they're very ashamed because i'm seeing them hiding their face um they're very ashamed they're very embarrassed uh, yeah, they just want to change this around. I feel like this person wants to heal things with you. Um, when they break it off with this karmic, this karmic is going to want to come and fight with you. Or there could be other people who, um, 
who are going to come and try to maybe defend the karmic. I don't know. But I feel like um, a lot of people are going to be upset with an earth angel it's almost like you're taking the blame because this masculine is coming to reunite with you i cannot make it up there's a lot of um bad energy being sent your way maybe from this karmic and her little friends uh, her it could be friends could be family members i feel like you're very protected you could be dealing with a Virgo. You could be dealing with um, a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, maybe an Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I'm getting the sense that your person may even want to protect you, okay? Because when they confront this karmic, they know that they're going to want to come after you. So I'm getting the sense, the way this sword is in front of you here, that this masculine is going to want to protect the earth angel, yeah, but they're getting ready to confront, okay? This is somebody who feels very stuck. They feel like jailed with this karmic, okay? Chained to this karmic somehow. They, this is something that they haven't been wanting to confront because they're worried about the karmic coming towards you. They're worried about a fight. Um, they're, they don't want to get in any more fights, okay? I feel like that's all that's being done is fighting about you, a lot of fighting um they're just so over this they don't they want out they want out and i feel like this person's going to fight their way out of that karmic situation but they have to do it in a way um so that no but there's no backlash on you this person's in love with you you could be dealing with a cancer pisces scorpio you could be a sagittarius Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, maybe Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. They can't take it anymore. This person's about to drop these burdens, okay? Um, they've been in a decision that they've had to make, right? Um, uh, needing to decide between two people, and I feel like they can't take it anymore. They want you. That's it. The heart knows what the heart knows the heart wants what the heart wants and this person wants their earth angel they're coming in to apologize they're coming in to get back together they want union okay um and they're about to confront this karmic show me more about this person show me about this karmic situation spirit show me about this devil justice this could end in a divorce if they're um if they're committed in a marriage with this karmic it's gonna they're gonna be telling them they want a divorce okay and the karmic is going to get irate i'm telling you she's gonna get irate she's mad because this person's making a decision they're making an, an executive decision and they're going to deal with the aftermath they don't care who thinks what about it this is an emperor your person's bossed up they're putting their foot down and i feel like they're coming in for their earth angel the karmic is going to be so furious about this and i feel like you see how this emperor has this enormous shield okay i feel like they know that this karmic is going to flip out and they're going to be protecting you. They're going to be guarding you. And then they're going to be coming in to apologize. Okay. Um, yeah, I feel like they're going to be handling this situation kind of like with an iron fist. They're going to be taking a stand. They're going to be like, don't, you know, this is what I'm doing. I'm leaving you. Um yes i'm going to my earth angel yes i'm going to apologize and don't do anything about it oh boy yeah oh yeah they're taking action that's it and this is definitely a divorce that's that's um coming with this the end to this karmic situation yeah that's what i'm seeing you could be dealing with the fire sign of a uh, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, maybe a, a Pisces. But this person, I feel like too, when they come towards you, they may be pretty ticked off, actually, 
because they would have just gotten done with a fight between this karmic and them. So, um, yeah, they're going to be feeling pretty heated. They're, yep, they're cutting this karmic out, I'm telling you. Yep, and they're protecting you. What did I just say? They're defending you, protecting you, um, speaking their truth, right? And they're doing it very brutally. Like this emperor, it's to the point where they just don't even care anymore what this karmic says. They want you, that's it. They see you as wifey, okay? This person's coming back around. They want their queen of pentacles. The one that they left out in the cold. Yeah, now they want to commit to you with the king of pentacles. We've got the queen to the king, yep. So this person's all bossed up. They're in emperor energy. They're going to be making this executive firm decision they're going to be guarding you. They're going to be defending you, um, not letting this karmic come towards you like it's over for them. They're going to be telling them they want a divorce, and they're coming towards this queen of pentacles, okay? They don't want to be out in the cold anymore. This is really burdening this person. Um, they're very sad. They don't want this. They want to heal this with you, the star. You got a lot of major arcana coming out in this reading, okay? All right, what else can you show me? Yep, and strength. So here they come. They've gotten their strength. They've gotten their courage. I feel like the more they speak their truth, the more courage they actually get, okay? The stronger they feel. They're going to be defending you with everything that they've got. Yep. And I feel like if you, here's the thing, they're coming towards you with all of the strength. You have the power to bring this person down if you wanted to. I feel like maybe you're at the point where you don't even want to talk to them anymore. So some of you may even turn this person away. Yeah, with the eight of, yeah, with the eight of cups on the bottom of the deck, you may turn this person away. Some of you will listen to this apology and you're going to be looking for all the red flags Empress to the Emperor. There it is. There it is. This could very well be possibly a twin flame soulmate connection, but I just feel like you're both ready now. Okay? You're both ready. You, I feel, have been waiting for this communication for far too long. Um, I, you may be just fed up with this. Yeah, you've been in a mental prison... Um, because of this person for too long okay but they're about to come forward with an apology a love offer and they're coming in um after they cut off this karmic okay yeah they want this new beginning this person is very fearful that you're going to reject them this could just be a fear um but afraid or not, they're doing it anyway. I'm just feeling this determination off of this person. Judgment on the bottom of the deck. Okay, what else can you show me? Yeah, here they come. There's that communication. There's them dropping all those burdens, right? Um, I feel like they're taking action. They're coming in for their earth angel. They want this new beginning with you. Oh, so bad. I'm telling you, they want it so bad. They can't seem to let you go. They can't forget about you. Yeah, this person's being spiritually led straight to you. Okay. Um, so yeah, whether you want to accept them back or not, ready or not, collective, here they come, basically is what it is. Ready or not, here they come. Okay, and they are coming in, I'm seeing it as single. Sorry, my deck was kind of messed up there. Okay, so I'm not going to be taking these in reverse, all right? All right, show me how this person feels, please. 
how are they feeling about my beautiful collective Yeah, see, they're getting their power back. Empowered, capable, strong. They, I, I feel like this person knows that they can get you back. They know that you love them. Okay, they do. They're worried about you rejecting them. Okay, that's what's kept them so hesitant. But, um, but they know you love them. They shouldn't have hurt you the way that they did. They're worried about you hurting them the way they hurt you. They're worried about um, being turned away and rejected. Some of you will reject this person. They're angry with themselves for the way they treated you because they know you didn't that you didn't deserve it. Yeah, you're actually their wish fulfillment, and they're over here feeling really guilty, in a lot of regret. That's the first card out. Okay. So this person is about to come forward with their tail tucked between their legs. They know that's how they have to do it. Because you know what? They broke your heart. They shattered it. And you didn't deserve any of that. And there's a tower moment here. Um, wherever they've been, uh, wherever this person was sitting in a comfort zone, that's about to be over with this with this lightning bolt right outside their window. I'm telling you, they're about to end it with this karmic and that's a confirmation <laughs> um, and you're just out here in this empress energy right um, getting wish fulfillment I feel like you've been getting a lot of wishes fulfilled but you were still waiting for this one communication I feel like all you wanted was justice you wanted your communication um, and uh, an apology, and you're about to get that too, okay? You could be a Virgo. They feel like crap. Yeah, look, I feel like this person is doing a lot of crying, feeling really guilty. They do not want to let you go. They're feeling kind of empty without you. Um, they're hoping that you communicate with them. They're hoping they don't get rejected. They want another chance. They're respectful of you now. I feel like it, this person, it seems like they didn't respect you before, but they do now. They admire you for um, because they know how much pain they put you through, and they know now um, they can see that you've healed, that you're um, independent. Yeah, they're, they're going to be coming in saying, I'm so sorry for what I did, right? I know I hurt you. I can't stop thinking about you. They're remorseful, regretful. This person could have changed a lot when you see them. Their looks have changed. I feel like they may have lost a lot of weight. Maybe they recently went through some kind of illness. This person's been under major judgment for how they um, mistreated an earth angel, okay? So, yeah, and they've been feeling really burdened. They just can't do it anymore. They can't take it anymore. They can't handle the regret anymore. It's eating them up. Look, the regret is eating them up alive, okay? They can't take it. They're about to approach you. They're, they've been longing for you, yearning for you. Maybe I feel like maybe even looking over your old photos, old text messages, this person could have written a letter that they haven't sent yet. They're very overwhelmed right now. Um, there could be issues going on, you know, like they can't keep their own life stuff together because they're thinking about you so much. They just can't take it, okay? And there, I feel like a, the karmic knows it. The karmic's been knowing that this person is coming towards you. She's worried about this. Yeah, because he can't take his eyes off of you. He's absolutely fascinated by you. So you're about to hear from this person. They're taking action. They want this new beginning. Okay. Yeah, this karmic. Oh, my gosh. She is going to be. She's going to be furious. Okay. Furious when this when she gets cut off oh my goodness so get ready because she's going to want to come in and fight i feel like this masculine's going to be um 
protecting you with everything they've got. She's already doing a lot of fighting about you, okay? Um, and he's defending you now. He's starting to step up and speak his truth. All right, what else can you show me? Yeah, they, he may even come right to your door. It could be a person-to-person -person communication. I feel like, you know, um, yeah, some of you may even decide that they're not for you anymore, that you're um, wanting somebody new. Okay, with Yang here. But they want to heal this. They want to clean up this mess. Yeah, a change is coming here one way or another. Whether you take this person back or not, your love life, I feel, is about to change. Either someone new is coming into your energy, into the picture now, or you're going to be taking this person back. But a change is imminent. Okay, a big change here in your love life is coming Yeah, some of you just want justice. Some of you just want the scales to be balanced out. You know? I feel like this person just showing up with an apology, that is your justice. Um, for some of you, that's going to be enough to release you from this and you'll be moving on peacefully. For others, I feel like you're going to be allowing maybe this person to come back in. Okay, this is something you've been wishing for, and it's being delivered to you. They're being, they're being led to you one way or another, okay? No matter what you decide, they're being led to come in and make this right. And I feel like it's, this is the energy that we're in right now. This is like current energy. Now, you've been sort of feeling like... Um, You've been stagnant, right? It's been a stalemate. You've been hovering here between the past and your future. So some of you may need to think about this as well for a while. But um, this is coming, and it's all about to change with the five. I'm telling you, big changes are coming in for you when it comes to love. You're being, um, you're being divinely led as well, okay? And look, here comes that message. I'm telling you, you're being led... Um, spirit is telling you to use your intuition, okay? Um, look at all the red flags, hear them out, hear what they have to say, and I feel like you will be making your own decision here. Some of you, I'm seeing some are leaving, you're going to be leaving this person behind, but some of you are going to be taking them back. So, yeah, get ready for this communication, it's coming, okay? Okay. Anyway, collective, that's what I've got for this quick reading. I, I do hope this helps. I hope it resonates. Um, like and subscribe to the channel, right? Join this awesome soul tribe. And until next time, everyone, take care of you and peace out.